Hey everyone, got a quick After Effects tutorial, very basic, and it deals with how to create a lower third. A lower third is that part you see at the bottom of a in screen programming on TV where something swoops in and says, Be right back or stay tuned for next episode. Uh, we're going to make a very simple one. It has to do with uh, the elements involved are solid and text and a little bit of keyframing. So it's very basic, but it'll help get someone started that may have a desire to learn what to do and how to proceed forward. So we'll open up After Effects and we're going to go to a new composition and let's make this 10 seconds. I've already entered that information in so it's going to be a 10 seconds duration. It's going to be HD 720, uh, 1280 by 720. So we'll start out with uh, a new layer and that new layer will be a new solid. We're going to make it white and we're going to reduce it in its height a little bit and with our keyboard we're going to hit the down arrow and move it down. You can move it faster by holding shift and the down arrow. So we're going to move it about right there. And next we're going to create a piece of text. So we're going to say stay tuned for more. Okay. And we'll position that right over here. Now, we need to lock the text to the, the solid. And you'll do that by selecting the text and take this pickwick and drag it to your white solid so that uh, they're bound together. So anytime you move the solid, the text also will move. Now, we're going to keyframe some opacity for the white solid. So if you expand that out and under transform, at the first frame, we're going to begin by moving or keyframing our position and our opacity. We want it to begin off screen at the first frame. So we're going to move it off screen. All right. And at this point we're going to tell the opacity of the white solid to be zero. All right. Then we're going to move in one second. We want to have a delay before this begins so we're going to move that forward one second and put in another keyframe which basically is the same as these first two. Then we're going to, we want the length of the swoop in to be let's say one half of a second. So we're going to split the difference in there and now we're going to begin by moving our solid and text back into position. Can't see it right now because it's the opacity is zero. But we're going to move that into position here. Get that lined up and now we're going to up the opacity to 75 percent. This way it'll be somewhat transparent. Okay. And if you see that we move through here, if we go back to keyframe one, play our footage, we have a one second delay and then it takes one half second for that to come into place and fade in. Okay. So now it's there. We want it to stay there for let's say six seconds or so. We're going to put in another keyframe and basically that holds everything's position, opacity, and tra any transformation. And we want it to exit off screen and it have a, a length of a half a second. So we'll move forward a half a second. We'll move it backwards. That's shift in the right arrow by the way to move that quickly. Okay, so that's off screen. And then we're going to change the opacity back to zero once it's off screen. So as it moves off screen it fades out. And you'll see that but right there we're about a quarter of a second and it's faded about 50 percent and then as it comes back in where it was originally it's you know the opacity was at 75 like we'd said it earlier. So we can do this and get a quick review. And so there it is. It's sitting there for some time. And then it will exit. Uh, you can also have beneath this th where you see black that will be transparent if you export this out as a, a quick time animation and retain its uh, alpha information uh, and you could have this overlay of video and the area that's white the white solid would be semi-transparent so you'll be able to see through that and see your footage beneath it so hope that helps you guys uh, if you like what you've seen please give me a thumbs up and if you like my channel Please subscribe. Hope to see you soon. Bye-bye.